Okay, it's March 11th, and a little update on what's going on with the brewing thing. Here we have the hop plants that I was given as a Christmas gift that were bought from the Grange. And all of them are alive, and all of them are sprouted, and some of them are quite long, as you can see. Yep. Just waiting for the last thread of frost before I plant those puppies in the ground. And here it is, the logerator. Dun dun dun. The stuff on the surface are uh, they're just there for weight. And if you listen, it's off. So it's maintaining a temperature of forty-five point seven eight degrees. So it is maintaining, and that's at a medium, the medium uh, setting. And I have keeping logs and all that stuff. But let's see what, it, what it's like on the inside. Take out this. Take out this weight. Take out this weight. It's just stuff I had around. And you take the highly technical lid off, and it's just uh, two inch rigid styrofoam insulation. And uh, this stuff is the expanding polystyrene foam sealant, and I sealed it all, and it also acts as an adhesive. So it's fairly solid. And in here is the refrigerator, and you can see right there is a fan. When I turn the fan on, it makes it a little colder in there. So that's just the little refrigerator that I already had. Whole, all told, um, cost was about $45 for a roll of tape. The sheet, it's one sheet of uh, 4x8 insulation. And I have some left over there, which I'm going to make a couple of baffles to go in here. And this just goes down like this. Make sure it lines up. Oh. One thing here is the that's uh, weather stripping around just to make a nice seal. Highly technical thermometer push through. Okay. You need an advanced degree to do that. Right there, kids. Let me take my tongue out of my cheek. Make sure this is lined up. Put the weights back on top, and that just pushes the insulation down just a bit. And the weights go back on top. Okay. I just adjusted the temperature. So let's see what it's like on the inside. As you can see, this is totally, you know, high tech. <laughs> uh, let's see. Oh, the yeast is heavy. Still bubbling. We're happy. Yeah, it's a little cold in there, so I just temperature it up a little bit. We'll see what happens. Being the first time I've used this logerator, uh, some fiddling to do. And there's actually things in it. But I guess it's better than keeping out in the garage. Then we take the weights just to make sure we get a nice tight seal on the uh, top. that weight and this weight mm. and now you see it's 52 it's lowering but the thing just kicked on so we're doing okay we're checking the edges make sure the weather stripping is in place yep we're good we'll check it in a little bit of time after some fiddling I got it down to Right around 50 degrees, which is perfect for what I have in here. And it's nicely contained. <laughs> Let's see what's going on inside. Take out the weights. Open the ever so sophisticated lid. And as you can see, I don't know if you can see in there, but that's like the lowest setting, the warmest setting I have it. And the fan is not on.
It looks pretty calm. It's actually feels like it's kind of not doing much of anything. We've been in here about a week and a half, so we might be almost done. All right. That's the logerator.